Okay. Wait, no. Okay. Let's see what happens here. Now this this isn't gonna fit with my headset on, is it? I don't think so. Okay. No big deal. So we just can't work. That's all there is about that. Okay. Hey, there's Sam. Uh, you're more than welcome to if you'd like. So we have, or yeah, Sam. Wow, Beth. There's Beth. Hi, Beth and Uni Russell. Konnichiwa. How is everyone doing? Uh, I don't know, Beth. I don't know what I wanted. And Ryan Plummer is here. Um, sorry, just checking a few messages real quick. I am going to be multitasking, but um, I had some time, and that is why I am here now. Um, uh oh, what is that? I just got something crazy going on. I need to pull up something. I apologize. What the heck just happened? I forgot to pull up my Twitch alerts. And what just happened? The Detroit Steel Wings, who I'm going to have to assume is not in the chat yet. Where is he? It's want to be like simple, or main top webcam spot, just little buttons and whatever you want, color in the background. That sounds great. Um, recovery is going great, the Assuming Mage. Thank you for asking. But before we get any farther, I have a minor announcement to make. The first ever donation to the stream was made, a $5 donation, by uh, the Detroit Steel Wings, who I'm going to have to assume is Crimson Seabed. And there he is. Thank you very much, Mr. Crimson. Uh, I am more than honored that you took the time to make a donation to Old Man Tup and the Pittsburgh Piratitas. Uh, just so you know, all donations are used to um, improve the Old Man Tup YouTube content and streaming content, which will either be through the use of uh, upgrading equipment, getting a better video card for the computer, uh, I am looking at buying a Blue Yeti microphone, um, and things of that nature. So um, it's not like I'm going to be going out buying pizzas if you decide to donate, but yeah, stuff and things. So thank you very much, Mr. Krim, for the first ever donation to this stream. And if you can, uh-oh, is Nightbot not here today? Nightbot, you're slacking. Did I misspell tweet? No. Apparently Nightbot is uh, off the ball and not wanting to make a click to tweet. Well, that's a bummer. But... And Heather is here. Hello, Heather. Welcome to the stream. And we're going to get all our notifications knocked out so we can sit down and start doing stuff and things. You know, I thought I had already activated Nightbot. Apparently, I was mistaken. So we're going to have to...
go and try and get his butt back in here. Okay. Yes, we would like him... Oh, we have to get started first. Lull! Okay, yes, I don't know why this is all reset. But... I'm doing very well, thank you. Who's Mr. Seeking? Okay, Nightbot, we want you. Nightbot has now joined the channel. I, I wonder if he times out if you don't stream for so long. I'm gonna have to guess that's what that is. Okay, there's Nightbot. Let's try that tweet again. There we go. If everyone would like to do me a favor and tweet out the stream, I would love you forever and always. And that would be bueno. Also, if you are not following the stream, even though I don't stream terribly often, when I do stream, you can be notified by simply following everything down below. Um, the reason there is no media is because all of my pertinent media is directly below the stream, so if you'd like to scroll down and check that, that would be muy bueno. And thank you, the Assuming Mage, for following. Bueno. Alright. Okay. Let's get... Let's get jiggy with it. We are gonna pull... We aren't gonna team build this team. Or this stream. We're going to get some battles with the team we had made in the last stream. So let's see how this goes. I'm gonna have to say this is a Mega Metagross team and that is scary as you know what. So let's go ahead let's GLHF this guy if he cares. Now what's he probably gonna lead? I would guess he's gonna lead either he might lead Ferrothorn? I don't know. He might, he might not. So let's... What the heck was that? Sound like someone sneezed on my porch. I'll be right back! Okay. Did old man chair hold down the fort while I was gone? I hope he did. Okay, now... Who is Suff Boy Bonya? Suff Bonya. Okay, this guy is taking his time. So we're going to make sure everything's back to normal. And it looks like it is. So let's... Um, I don't know what this guy's waiting for. He'd probably just straight up destroy my team. Hey, there he goes. He wasted all that time to bring out Lander Assyrian. And I forgot to disable Skype alerts. So my bad. Bring that back up. Bring this back up. Okay. He says hi, I said look, good luck, have fun, okay. Apparently he was uh, dropping a deuce and not paying attention. Anyways, let's... What do we want to do here? He's not going to stay in, and this is his only ground type. So I mean, we get a free Volt Switch, we get Hydro Pump. Let's... Is he going to U-turn out? Let's just go for the Hydro Pump. He is going to U-turn... Oh, Volt Switch would have been so nice there. But he even goes into Vaporeon. And we're choice locked, so that's that's fantastic. Let's go ahead. Go out here. Hey, Kelly's here. 
Okay. And he's going to go into this. And we have the Magnet Rise. So let's... Let's see if we can pull some shenanigans off on this guy. Go for Earthquake, please. Yes! Yes! It worked one time, and that is all I need. So let's go ahead and set up spikes on this thing. Of course he's going to go into Chandelure. Oh, if we'd have busted off a T-Wave there, that would have been so nice. So nice. So what can we go into that is going to body hits from this? Absolutely nothing. So let's... We got a set of spikes up. Can we... Can we T-Wave this thing safely? I mean, we'll be able to bring in a counter once it's T-Waved. Let's go ahead and T-Wave it. It's gonna trick us here. We got the Choice Scarf, he's got the leftovers. And I'm perfectly fine with that. We could go for the Play Rough. I mean, just to... Well, that's not gonna be... Let's get up another set of spikes. Gonna bring in the Ferrothorn, not even worried about that. So we got two layers of spikes up. He's gonna bring in the Ferrothorn. I don't wanna... Hmm. Does Ferrothorn carry knockoff? I don't wanna go into Sandy Claws, get knocked off, and lose out on my Poison Heal regeneration. I, I, I really wanna say he's gonna Leech Seed here. So at the same time, I want to go into this. He's been making smart plays so far. Let's... Let's go into Water Boy, see what he's going to do. He's going to curse. Okay. Okay, I can deal with that. We will just go ahead and trick him here. And now he's got the choice specs, and he's going to leech seed, and that's going to miss. And our opponent has disconnected. So tell me we aren't going to get... And Jess is here. Hello, Jess. How are you? And our opponent's left. Um, I don't know that he is or isn't doing something good or bad. So let's see. He's probably just leaving, so now is a good time to take a nice refreshing drink of black cherry clear clear American water. The carbonated kind. You know, the, the rip on clearly Canadian that you buy at Walmart, the good stuff. Delicious. Um, yeah, stuff and things. So this guy's gonna time out, which is a bummer, but I mean experience for us, I guess. But I guess he just couldn't handle it after Ferrothorn got stuck on something. So, we have successfully won a match. Now, let's see if we're going to get a quick ladder update here, or if we're going to have to wait 30 seconds. I don't want to wait 30 seconds, because I'm patient. A lot of that's going on on Skype right now. Krim knows what I'm talking about. Um... Yeah, we're not waiting. So let's go ahead, jump in. Oh, but, all right, here we go. So we got Hoopa Unbound running around. Scizor, Thunderous, in, this one's the eye, the eye form, right? Incarnate, Gliscor, Heatran. <coughs> Excuse me. So I'm going to say Waterboy's our best lead here because it really handles his team. There isn't much his team can do to Waterboy. And he's going to lead Gliscor. Now, do I show this guy how big my balls are and go for a Volt Switch? Or do I just straight up Hydro Pump because it's the best play? probably going to protect to see what I want to do. So let's go for Hydro Pump here. And he is, because, well, that and he does want to get burnt. But what he doesn't know is that we are choiced. Now, if he were smart here, and I'm not saying that he is, 
Apparently, Nightbot does not like a lot of caps. My apologies, Crimson. I will work on fixing that later. Wow. One shot in that son of a gun. So we forgot to good luck have fun at the beginning of this. Apparently, I need to uh, up my caps lock amount. Now... So that just deleted his stuff. I didn't ban him, right? Yeah, okay. Let's see. I don't really have a switch in for this. I mean, I could go into... What does he have that could hit this hard? Not a lot. Let's go ahead into Clef Key. He's probably going to Drain Punch. Oh, he's going to Hyperspace Fury. We resist that, and it still does over half. That is why this thing is just stinking broken. So, the smart play will be a T-Wave, but he could bring in this. He doesn't have Gliscor anymore. Hmm. We could go with the T-Wave, but I really want to get a layer of spikes down. Well, no. Go for the T-Wave, be smart. Okay, he brings in Thunders, he makes a good play. That's not a bad play. And he's got leftovers. Dang it, we should have just set up spikes. Okay. So what do we what are we going to for this? If he's got HP ice, that's bad news bears. Um Let's just set up spikes. He's gonna T wave us, which I'm I'm really not worried about. I wanna get the spikes up for residual damage, because I'm that guy. Okay, T bolt not gonna be enough to take us down. Which I'm most glad about. I just, I don't really see a need for Clef Key beyond this. Let's go ahead and, okay, he's going to T-Bolt and finish us off. Not bad. Mind if I battle, um, if you're referring to me? I'm feeling very well, Kelly, thank you for asking. I do not mind in the slightest. However, now we go into Razzy. Go for the fake out to get residual damage on whatever. But, um, right now we're probably just going to be getting mostly random battles to. Yeah, stuff and things. So he's going to stay in. I don't really know why he did that. Is he baiting the ice punch? Because I, I really think return's probably the best play here. We do outspeed this thing, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, we outspeed this thing. He's going to paralyze us. That's why he stayed in. But he's not really. We're just for fakes. He's there. Oh, bait and switch, my friend. Bait and switch. So, um, I really hope this... Oh, we got the toxic off right there. Bueno. So we're going to set up the stealth rocks. And just be like, you can keep getting jelly about this. All right. So Rezzy has challenged me to OU. We will get to that in a moment. I only do one battle at a time because I have enough trouble with paying attention to a single battle because I'm that guy. Okay, nothing there. Mm. Now, is this thing going to be... Specs, Scarf... We didn't see any, any recovery. Could be Life Orb. He's probably going to be faster than us in just about everything. Now, I, uh, oh, I don't have Protect. Dang. Is he going to overpredict here and go for a water move? No, we do not have any cool commands, uh, Razy. My apologies. I haven't gotten quite that uh, sophisticated with this yet. Probably Scarfed. Let's, let's go into Water Boy. He's got Icy Wind. Well, well, well. I think it's a speed drop, and there's the life orb. Okay. Okay. That is not what I wanted to see. Now, we can freely volt switch here. Because anything he brings in is going to get hit by it. I mean, even... 
Yeah, let's just Volt Switch here. He goes for the Sacred Sword. Not going to be enough to take us out. We're going to Volt Switch, and that is going to take down Keldeo. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Dun, 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 ski. Okay. So we're just going to bring this back out, because he doesn't have an Intimidator. He could Prankster T-Wave, but we outspeed at this point, so we are just going to be getting free damage on things. So let's... I mean, fake out his free damage. He's going to Mega up here. That was a crit, and it did that much. That is no bueno. So what's he going to want to do here? Thank you, everyone, that is tweeting out the stream. I do see that Jess dropped the command tweet for the click to stream. We could go into Waterboy here, but I kind of want to keep him around as fodder. Let's go into Cayente. I, mean, I really think that's our best move here. He's going to Sword Stance. I don't think he can hit us with anything that's really going to matter. And a Sacred Fire is going to hit everything except for his um, Heatran. So do we want to go? We have to go here. Yep, had to do it. Couldn't risk him staying in and going for like a Brick Break or something and destroying us. So he's going to bring in the Heatran here. Does he have the Balloon? Does not have the balloon. He could be scarfed. He could be scarfed. And Alakazan and Ryquins here. Nice and Rye. Oh, he left. Man. So uh, we're two and zero. Oh. Um. Yes, Lopani is Razzy. Don't you remember the last time I streamed? We did that. So um, Alakazam, who is Owen, is here. Yeah, we got all the cool kids showing up. Okay, and um, Rezzy has challenged us, so we will accept that. And we'll use the stream team. Oh no, he's got Mega... Mega Sharpedo. Okay. So let's drop the GLHF, as this is a stream opponent. So, good luck. And have fun, Mr. Uh... Rez, Ray, Razy, Ray, Razy. Okay. All right. Now let's let's give a quick look at this team and see what our best lead option is going to be. Now, the only thing on his team that's going to want to come in for Water Boy, I mean, ultimately, is going to be Celebi. Not, not much. Not a lot. Um, shoot. I, I could just lead with Razzy. The only thing that's gonna wanna come in on that, right off the bat, is nothing. Let's lead with Razzy. Okay, and we're just gonna mega up and fake out on the first turn because that's what you do. So he's going to switch out, and he's going to get the rough skin. Wow, that did over... No rough skin. He's speed boost. That's right. Now this thing doesn't have fake out. Does it? No. No. So we're... He's going to protect to get the speed boost. We go for the drain punch. He stays in. At plus one, do we outspeed this? We'll find out. We don't. Okay, good. No flinch. Um, that did. Uh, I thought that would do more damage. Okay, out comes the Keldeizzle. Now. We're gonna go into Water Boy. Because unless he has HP Grass, he isn't going to... Oh, that does so much damage. That is going to make me... Dang, everybody is streaming right now. That is going to make me think that he specs just because that did so much damage. And he's going to outspeed us because we're modest. 
And that's no bueno, because we're not going to live another one of those. So let's... Let's play the game and see what happens. We're going to go back out. Okay, Sacred Sword, he must be Specs. Alrighty. So, what's he got on his team? He's got two things that could come in on the Psy Shock. Wow, that is our best play, though. If he goes into Heatran, a Draco Meteor is not going to get us very far. Oh, he has three things that could come in on a Psy Shock. That is no bueno. Uh, I think that's the way we have to go here. Yeah, he goes into Heatran because... Now, what's he going to do here? We're going to switch out into Waterboy because he isn't going to be able to do much to us. He's going to Lava Plume. Doesn't get the burn, which is good for us. Now, a Hydro Pump would be really nice, but I really think he's going to switch out expecting a Volt Switch or the Hydro Pump. And I really think Celebi's coming in. So let's... Let's get a little cheeky and go out into Entei. And see what happens. If he switches into Celebi right here, that would be so good for us. Oh, he goes out into this. That is not what I wanted to see. I got a Volt switched right there, and that would have been Dundee Bischoff. Okay, now we need to analyze the situation. Oh. Okay. So, Gino the dog, welcome to the stream. Let's. This thing's gonna be faster than us because we're adamant. So, that's. That's just booty pipe. And we are in a really bad situation because we don't have anything that really wants to come into a Specs Keldeo attack. We don't have Roost on this. Yeah, that Keldeo is killing me. Okay, so what do we want to do? We could probably survive a Specs, whatever he's going to do. Then T-Wave it, then it's not an issue. So let's do that. Entei is not banded, so he's going to Icy Wind. That's a He was expecting Latios to come in there. Uh, okay. Now, he's not going to stay in and do that again. So let's set the spikes. And see what happens. No, Entei is not banded. Entei is expert belt, if I'm not mistaken. Um, just a quick reminder to the stream, if you have not yet, please go ahead. And we have uh, two new followers since our last tech, Jesper and... Razy, who we are currently battling. So thank you guys for the follow. Okay, thank you for stopping by, Jess. It was great to see you. So we did get those spikes up, which is good. Now what do we want to go into to body a fire hit? I don't know. I mean, he's got to go for the fire move here again. That makes the most sense. We could probably take one. Get another layer of spikes up. That's going to hurt everything really good except for Latios. So let's do that. He's going to set up rocks. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. That would have been a really good time to switch out. Man, I'm a bonehead. Okay, let's... Let's go ahead and T-Wave here. Because why not? And we do take one of those. I don't want to say well, but... Not Terra bad. Okay, now... We 
got two layers of spikes up. I really think he's just gonna go for fire move. I think at this point we sack off Water Boy to get a good switch in. Oh, the para hacks. Okay, now at this point, what do we want to do? If I was him right now, I would probably sack this off. A Specs Hydro Pump right now is going to hit anything really hard. I'm going to bring in Latios, and we're going to miss... Ugh. Freaking balls. Okay. Let's... Let's... Let's go back out into Pokemon. Expecting the Draco. He's going to defog. Okay, well that gets everything off the field, and I'm perfectly fine with that. Now... Is he going to be cheeky, stay in? No, I really think the only reason he went out here was to get the defog off. I'd really like to T-wave this thing, though. He's going to bring Heatran right back out. So... Mm. I really want to pull the trigger and just go out into Cayente, but... Let's go back out into Waterboy. If he, he isn't going to switch. He stays in. He's got Hidden Power, which is Hidden Power Fire. <sighs> I'm not real enough. I am not real enough. Man, if I'd have just stayed in and T-Wave right there... I would be so much happier right now. So what he has? Defog, HP, Fire. What, does he got the same set we do? Psyshock and Draco? <sighs> dang it, dang it, dang it. Well, let's go back out into this. We're especially defensive. We'll take a Hidden Power Fire. Now he's going to switch out, because now he knows that a T-Wave is coming. Or he's going to stay in and go for the defog, expecting the hazards to come back up. Ugh. Mother fricker. Of course. Now that we don't have anything to come in and body a fire move like we did. Now he's going to come back in. I think he's going to set up the rocks. Fudge it. We're going out into Sandy Claws. Oh, the Earth Power. Bueno. Okay, now. I go for the knockoff here, but if he brings this thing back out, there will be an issue. But he might not want to bring that out on an Earthquake. I really think he's going to go into Latios. Of course. Why didn't I just Earthquake? Freaking crap. Alright, we, we gotta go into this. Is it gonna Icy Wind? That's fine. We just kinda have to sack this thing off right here. This is not going to end terribly well for us, I don't think. item are we? Life Orb. He's going to be faster than us because of the speed drop. Alright. we got to bring Razzy Bunny back out here because she's just going to wreck face now. We get the fake off off. The fake off off. Fake out off. We'll be bueno. Um, could go into Heatran here. Okay, he's gonna flinch. Now, obviously he wants to get something in safe. I mean, unless he's scarfed, we're out, out speeding. And I think based on damage, he specs. So, 
Just gonna go for the return because it's our safest play right now. And see what he brings in after that. Oh yeah, barring Scarfers, we should outrun the rest of his team. He's gonna bring in the Heatran. I think he's leftover variant. So we should one-shot this thing. I mean, unless he's trying to bait and switch moves here. I don't know. I don't know. So let's see what happens. Gonna drain from... Wow, that didn't do anything. It's gonna love a flume no... Oh, the burn! Son of a biscuit. And that is gonna suck because now we're gonna lose all that power that we would have just wrecked the rest of his team with and we get a crit on the drain punch which I mean obviously negates the burn <sighs> Heatran is down though so this is more I don't want to say it's fodder Shrek is love Shrek is life who is Shrek oh Celebi Oh, speaking of Celebi, what's he going to do here? Oh, he's going to recover stall me. Maybe we'll get a freeze. That'd be fun, wouldn't it? I just need to have some damage on this thing, which I'm not going to have because he's just going to recover at the end of this turn. So that's no bueno. What did he do there? Oh, he giga drained. So we're going into Cayente. And we're just sacred firing for our life here. Sacred fire. Are you kidding me? We're expert belt, right? F my life. How did that not kill Adam and Expert Belt Sacred Fire? Holy freaking crap. Huh. I just messed my mind up. Uh, and speaking of Celebi, I believe it is Cerebi's like 10th anniversary today or something. So, Psy Shock isn't going to be enough to take us out. Another extreme speed, provided we don't get flinched, is going to be enough to take him out with Life Orb Recoil, if he doesn't. Okay, he's got one Mon left. <laughs> so, all we can do is Earthquake here and hope for the best. If he has HP Ice... And he does... Oh, the crit! Or the... Yeah, the crit. Wow. Learn to talk, Tup. A clutch live. Clutch live. Now, did he... He's not life-orbed. Is he choiced in some manner? If he is, we won. Because HP Ice ain't gonna do diddly squat to me. Let's see, let's see, let's see. This is our special defense wall. We might be able to take a hit from this thing. And a play rough at this range has to take it down. Has to. Oh, we take the Thunderbolt! Oh, and the play rough! Woo! Wow, that was a good game. Holy crap. I think this guy said he was 12. Holy smokes. Played me like a fiddle that whole match. Jeez Louise. Okay. So, I think we're going to go for a random battle now. And let me check something real quick. See what's going on. Okay, no progress check a few more things here okay no more followers 
So let's let's check something real quick and see if no no we're not gonna we're not gonna monkey with that just yet because that would take way too long. Okay, while we're in between battles, if you guys would like to uh, click on the click to tweet I would love you forever and let some people know that we are streaming uh, hello I can never say your name right so we're gonna call you Joe 3M or Joe Joe uh, um, Joe what's going on man I recognize you as you are constantly commenting on my videos so thank you very much for being a supporter of the channel so um Rezzy I think that's gonna be the only battle we take that isn't random for now maybe we'll do some challenges uh, more towards the end of the match and oh the ugliness of this team is just making me want to cry okay so let's go ahead Give this guy good luck. Have fun. So let's see what we can do. Yeah, apparently not that much wisdom. Okay, so let's see what we can do here. What do we want to do against this team? Uh, freaking crap. All right, well, let's just lead with Waterboy. Waterboy always seems like our best option to lead off here. Now, oh, I kind of just want to trick right off the bat because I think Quagsire is coming in and chick blah, blah. tricking that I think would be really good for us. So he, tell me he's going to U-turn straight into Quagsire Come on, go straight into Quagsire. Zapdos. That is not what I wanted to have. That, what do we get from it? Leftover. So this is going to be a bulky variant. So we could probably... Actually, a Hydro Pump is going to do more damage for us. Let's see. Let's see what he's got. He's probably expecting the Volt Switch there. Why wouldn't he go into Quagsire? Ex Unaware Quagsire. Unreal. Unreal. Couldn't take the Hydro... So he has nothing on his team to take a Hydro Pump. Wow. What did I think of Mag's preseason press conference? I thought it was brilliant and well put together like almost any promo spot he does. If there's one thing I can say about Mag, he's one of the funniest people I've ever met. And it's not hard for him. It's hard for me to be that funny. Honestly. Anytime you laugh and see something I do, it was incredibly hard for me to be that funny. Now, I really want to... <sighs> He's going to be locked into whatever he does. I kind of just want to volt switch into Sandy Claws and see what he does. But at the same time, I don't want to get HP iced in the face. But I stayed in and went for it before. Aw, oh, he left! Well, I guess he realized that he didn't have an answer to Rotom. And just kept going. Aw, oh, man. That would have been a good match. Okay. Okay. So let's do one more look for battle, and then Joe uh, 3M would like to challenge the stream dream team. So if you want to go ahead, we will see you later, Heather. Thank you for stopping by the stream. Excuse me. 
I think half the GBA is streaming right now. So let's take a look. Um, Jome, if you want to drop that... Again, I th think this is our best lead. Hit him on top. Oh, he's got hit him on top. Pro play. Um, Joam, if you want to go ahead and drop a challenge, my name is Old Man Tup, as you can see on the screen. And once this match is over, I will accept and we will get started. Um, OU, I prefer to play. So now we could choice this thing, and that would be beautiful. So he's going to get the fake out off on us, and he's going to realize... Close combat. Wow! That did so much damage. We have an assault vest. <laughs> okay, I'll change the team. No problem. We will use a different tier. Explain to me why I hear Tup talking, but my stream says he's offline. The trick. That was happening against... Who was, who was having that issue earlier, too? I think it was... Um, Ryquin did, and he just had to refresh. So we're going to go into... We're going to go into Sandy Claws here. And we're just going to go ahead... And... Um... Someone's posting links. Thank you, Nightbot, for checking that. Okay. Now, what do we want to do here? I kind of want to knock off because I think he's going to switch into something else. So let's go ahead. He's going to stay in. He obviously didn't want that hit on top anymore. Or he just didn't want something coming in and getting knocked off. Okay. So another freaking Keldeo to cause us problems. Now, we're going to have to believe the ice or pump. Scald is coming. Not worried about it. That didn't do a lot. No life orb, so he's, I'm going to say probably uh, specs. Uh, Razy, if we get that far, I would be more than happy to. Now, he has two options to come in and not get T-waved. But honestly, I just want to set up a layer of spikes and see what he goes into. He's going to go into Landorus. And we will get the Magnet Rise off and Giggity. Unless he just U-turns. We are going to get the Magnet Rise. He's going to knock off. Not even worried about that. What did he knock off? Leftovers. Fine by me. So we're going to get another th set of spikes. He's going to superpower. His attack is going to be lowered. We're going to be able to bring something in and take it easy because now we know that he is not um, choiced. So we could just easily bring in Sandy Claws. And we haven't seen his item yet. But we know he's not, well, that's because he hasn't made damage. He probably has leftovers. Okay, so I, I wanna say knockoff here, but I really think he's just gonna go back out into Keldeo. So let's... An Earthquake is going to hit anything on his team that he brings in. Goes into Alakazam. Earthquake. Why would you bring in Alakazam of all things? But, um, well, probably the rest of his team outspeeds me. So here comes Keldeo. <sighs> and he went for Scald last time. I really think he's going to go for Ice this time. Uh, let's just go here. He's going to Scald us. It's not going to do much. And I really think he's going to have to switch here. And he has nothing that wants to come into a Draco. Nothing. He has nothing that wants to take a Psy Shock, though, either. I really think that's... Oh, but Draco's just going to kill anything that comes in. Got to go for the Draco. What?! 
Are you ballsing me? He survived a Draco meteor. Alright, well, we've got to finish it with Psy Shock here. Okay, well, I mean, that's fine with me. I mean, ultimately, I don't want to say no harm, no foul there. But, I mean, he went for a sub. What did he think I was going to do? I, I'm a little lost on that um, sequence of events there. Now, I really think he's just going to U-turn here. And that would be his best play, unless he wants to set up rocks. Okay, he's going to knock off here. That's not going to do much because obviously we're this guy. So um, we're going to set up rocks here because he isn't going to be able to do anything to us. So we have everything set up that we need, so we're just going to go for a knockoff of our own. And it was a salt vest. And we're going to be able to stall this guy. I, I hope he realizes that. Now that he has no item... He should just... Well, he's going to stay in because he doesn't want anything coming in and getting wankered. Or he's waiting until he gets us low enough that he can switch in expecting a roost considering he hasn't seen my final move yet. Okay. And... How much did the crit do? How much did the crit one do? 34%. Okay, we're just going to keep knocking off. Superpower. <sighs> I'm going to be that guy in Roost here. Okay, now after... Two poison heals, I'll be back at full health. <sighs> now he has to have HP ice on this Manectric. But I think I can survive. Oh, but I really need this thing if I want any chance of beating that Darmanitan. So let's go into Kayente. It's gonna come on, HP ice me. Yes! We're gonna survive that. We're gonna extreme speed. T-Bolt, Flamethrower, Volt, Switch, HP, Ice. Oh, okay. Well, he left. And we are cruising our way into the 1300s. Not that that is a huge accomplishment by any uh, stretch of the imagination. Um, I need to check a tweet real quick. Uh, I apologize for the... Wow, we have 11 notifications. I'm sure that's normal for most people, but not for me. Thank you, everyone, who is forwarding the stream. Okay, so I thought I saw someone ask me a question. Thank you, everyone, for forwarding what you have forwarded. Oh, and there's my dude. Crimson Seabad, working on a layout for me. He's so cold. Consecutive losses counter. Shut up, Steve. <laughs> um. Did I miss anything else? No. I do have to reply to Crimson real quick. Okay, let's let's exit this. Joan, I hope you're around and ready. I'm going to use this team that I haven't used in a long time, but it was from a friend, and it was a really fun team to use. Wow, Aromatisse. And this is my GBA team from last season. 
Oh, man, I'm gonna get my butt whooped with my own team. That's... that's... that's not fun. And there's Joe. Hi, Joe. And there's Luke. How's it going, Luke? Good to see you. Uh, tweeting something real quick, being super unprofessional. And like I said, me being super unprofessional. Oh no, what's going on? Things are exploding. Oh god. Steve is being a turd. Okay, no. We're getting out of there. Ah, okay. No problem, I don't mind you putting the timer on. Okay, and I am not going to ignore spectators unless you start I don't want to say getting annoying but I don't want any reveals especially since we're just playing a friend and I don't want any uh, yeah reveals team ruining whatever you want to call it now what's he gonna lead with he's got aromatisse which is just all in all bamf so this outspeeds my entire team and the only thing it doesn't handle is a zoomerol. Now we have noisy butters, which really puts a wall up on his team. <sighs> We're gonna lead with this. So he's gonna lead with Mammoth Swine. And we will outspeed anything aside from a scarfed Mammo. So there is Luke please hit the click to tweet that was dropped in the chat. Greatly appreciate it. So, Mamo's out. And... Mamo... What's he have on his team? I really think a Focus Blast is a, a good move to go for here. No, no. Gonna go for the Solar Beam. It hits everything on his team as good, if not better, than Focus Blast. And it's guaranteed to hit. If he goes into a Zoomerol... Oh, he went into that. Why couldn't you go in what I wanted you to go into? Solar Beam, that's going to do nothing. And we'll speed tie this thing? Maybe? Yeah. So what's he going to do here? We don't have a Steel type on this team. But he isn't going to go for a Dragon type move because we have Noisy Butters. Do we go into Potato Gym? Let's go into Potato Gym, because he has all the defenses, in, or all the special defenses in the world. He's gonna Fire Fang, wow. Not bad, not bad. So this is a physical variant. What is my physical wall here? It's so long since I used this team. Oh, I don't have one, do I? Lol, I forgot, this is the not bulky team. Ha, ha. Just lost the match. Okay, let's see what he's gonna do. And did he take... Uh, he didn't take life orb damage there. So he could be scarfed. Or choiced in some manner. We're just gonna set up the rocks there. Best move we could make. I really think our best move at this point is to go back out into Charizard Y and I just I just think it is goes for the waterfall wow wow that's banded damage that is banded damage oh, I can't over predict here that might not have been banded damage no, it can't be Sap Sipper. That did too much damage for him not to be huge power. Because Azumarill's base attack is only 50, I think. Or, no, maybe 75. What is its base attack? Oh, it doesn't say. I just have to go for the Solar Beam. He's gonna Aqua... That wasn't banded damage. Holy freaking crap. I 
let's regain our composure. Jeez Louise. Hey, Jamie's here. How's it going, Jamie? So here we go. And all we are going to do is head smash the things. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Head smash counter one. Now, I would really think... He isn't... Mm. You go for the ice shard here. Is that super effective? Rock doesn't resist ice, does it? I'm doing very good, Jamie. Uh, the battles are going good. I think we've actually won them all so far. Head smash. Wow, that didn't take it down. Oh, and the icicle crash is going to miss. That is extremely unfortunate. Maybe if we're lucky. And the demonic is here. What program? I, um, uh, it is called Stylish, I believe. Um, it's for Google Chrome. Okay, icicle. Wow, that icicle whatever would have definitely taken me out at that point because. Whew. Now I don't want this to go out yet. Oh no, we don't have Charizard to switch into. We can go into Noisy Butters, but that's not good for us yet. Let's... <coughs> Pardon me. That's what you get for drinking carbonated water on stream. The burpees. Man, I really don't have a, anything good to go into at the moment. Let's... Shoot. Let's go into Bianca and see what he's going to do. Got the flash cannon, okay. Glad I didn't go into Noisy Butters there. Wow, flash cannon wrecks all of my team. Not good. Not Okay, he's got the leftovers. <clears throat> Should have been paying attention there. I'm going to set up the roost here. Expecting a switch out into... I don't even know. You're gonna roar me out. I'm gonna bring out the noisy butters. Oh. What's he gonna do? We have to go <clears throat> for the HP ground here. He's faster than us. Holy crap. Alright, Luke, thanks for making it out. So now we could probably take a flash cannon. We could always take one. And if this thing was gone, my life would be much easier. Okay. Now, let's see what he wants to do. He's gonna flash cannon. We are gonna survive. The hidden power will take it out. I'm specs, and that... Wow. <clears throat> wow. Wow. Okay, he obviously figured out him specs. He's gonna go into Mence. But what's he gonna do here? I really feel my best play... And we're getting the... Get a Dragon Claw, which I'm not scared of. We do have rocks up already, so let's... What's he got? Let's just go ahead for the Stone Edge, because that's going to hit everything on his team. Stone Edge, nice and hit. Thank you very much, Ivan... Valde? Val Valdez. My apologies for not reading that properly. Thank you for the congratulations. Um, I was very surprised they didn't demote me to the D-League after only winning one game. <clears throat> and the Focus Blast is going to hit. And, oh man. Do I have the cojones? Why not? Forgot to Mega. That is no bueno. So let's knock off here. 
Even if it brings in Aromatisse, that's gonna get rid of whatever item it has. Might have actually been better for him to not Mega Evolve, aside from the fact he doesn't outrun me or outspeed me. Yeah, that's resisted and <clears throat> stuff and things. That might ultimately be really bad for him. So let's just Icicle Crash here. See how much damage we can get. Probably gonna um, Moonblast. Oh, nice. Very nice. So we're gonna bring this back out. And I think at this range, Earthquake is gonna mop up and we don't have to worry about anything missing. Okay, thank you, Ivan, for that. It is uh, greatly appreciated, and I'll keep you in mind. Oof. Psyshot gonna take us out, and he's gonna... Hmm. Yeah, I thought I'd kill too. That is why you never underestimate Mega Alakazam. So let's see what moves he's packing. He's got the Shadow Ball. Oh, we're going to survive. And the Draco is going to connect. So GG. Jome. Jome. Alrighty. Okay. Ivan Valdez. Um, to make sure that what we are talking about happens, do me a favor and make sure you tweet at me on Twitter and all I want you to tweet at me is stuff and things. That's all it has to be in the tweet. That way, that's the easiest way for me to connect with people. Let, let's go old school. We're gonna play Razy again. Now we're gonna go old school with this with this team. He's gonna bring this team again, okay. This team doesn't have quite as much trouble. Well, let me let me check my team. This team has even more trouble with Keldeo than the last one. Bueno. Okay, so let's drop the GL. HF. Hey, Reunicuzzle. Rebe. Reunicuddles is here. How's it going, Reunicuddles? Well, thank you for stopping by, Jome, and for the battle. That was a very fun battle. <clears throat> Okay, I need to check something before this battle starts. Okay, no progress, so we can continue. Oh, hip starting to lock up. Oh, let me get a stretch real quick. Blah. Getting old as hell, kids. So, enjoy your body while it still works. I'm gonna drink more stuff to make me burp so I can look attractive on stream. Because that is what we're all about. Okay. Let's bring that back up. Okay. So last time, Rotom Wash was the best lead. And this is a different Rotom Wash. Oh, none of these mons are named. That's okay. It's going to bring out Keldeo. Who I am not even worried about. Can't hit me for much. Um, Does not have a ground type. So Volt Switch is going to hit everything really good. Um, Celebi was, I believe, the physical wall last time. Okay. Okay, Ivan, um, I understand that you follow me, but what I need you to do, if you haven't already, is actually tweet at Old Man Tup including stuff and things so I know that it's you so that I can follow you back and we will discuss what you have proposed if that makes sense so we are just gonna straight up volt switch out of here that is gonna hit <laughs> the season 4 pirate it is keep on losing I, I don't know man I just couldn't win with that team That's, I thought I drafted a bunch of mons that I was good with and I realized once I had them I drafted a bunch of mons that can't take hits. And that was just like, oh, snarkiness. Okay, is, is Razy still here? 
Yeah, he had to send out his mon. Okay, so Subway's gonna... <laughs> that is what I named... One of my Heatran. Oh, is this substitute Heatran? Get out. What do you mean? No, literally, I want you to, at Old Man Tup, stuff in things. That's what I want the tweet to say. Stuff in things. Yes, what Reunicuddle said. Literally, stuff in things. But yeah, I, I agree, Jome. The defensive Mons on that team had no recovery at all until I got Aromatisse in like week five, and even then, I wish passing is really hard in the league. Okay, so Heatran's out here. My best. That's okay. It's okay. It's it's hard to understand because when I tell you to do stuff and things, you're like, well, what stuff and things? Completely understandable that I'm dumb. Okay. Um. Oh, that's right. I volt switched. Giggity. Okay. Let's just go ahead. Earth power. I'm gonna set up the stealth rock. Um. This is my specially defensive. Uh, Jigaboo. What's his name? Empoleon. Who is one of my all-time favorite starters, True Facts. Get the burn. Give me the burn. Snag it. Yes! Snag the burn! Woo! Residual damage on this thing is going to help me so much, I will cry. <sighs> okay, this is a bulkier Rotom. So this might be able to take that Sacred Sword a little bit better. And I snag the burn, and he snags a crit. I suppose it's fair. I suppose. Not what I wanted to happen to this Rotom Wash, who kind of poo-poos all over his team. Oh, he's got Snorlax, yeah. Okay. So another Sacred Sword might not take me out. Crit was 70%, so another one's going to do around 50 so yeah, another one will take me out. Dang it. That is not what I wanted. Okay, checking Twitter now. Holy crap. Okay, there is Ivan Valdez. Alrighty. Okay, Ivan, we are now follow friends on the Twitters. Okay. Oh. Sorry. Uh, what do we want to do here? We are so boned by this thing. <sighs> okay, sorry, absolutely no links are allowed to be posted. Um, just for the protection of bot spam. So, uh, Ivan, we can talk about it later. That's not something I want to discuss on stream. Just because it won't uh, detract from my attention of things. So we need to figure out something to go into for this. 350. Wow, oh, speed that thing. Wow. Nothing on his team outside of that wants to take a shadow ball. Only one thing on his team wants to take a sludge bomb. Whoa, oh, whoa, whoa. It's no problem, and I understand. It's just natural you want to link me to a pronunciation. So we're going to find out if this thing is Scarfed or Spexed. I've been assuming it was Spexed because of how much damage it did to Rotom last time. So I'm going to have to assume that that's what it is. Okay, I will do Ivan. Probably do that more towards the end of the stream. Well, after the stream. Okay, if this thing takes a Shadow Ball, that's a critical hit. How much damage does that do? 69 after a crit. So that's, what, 150% of normal damage. So, like, take 20 off that. We've only done, like, 45%, right around half. And that is just poopy. That means this thing's a salt vest. 
361, which means it can outspeed us, but Assault Vest will be bulkier. Oh. I gotta go into Gliss score. I have to. It's gonna Shadow... Okay. Okay, I can deal with that. I can deal with the Shadow Balls. I can deal with the Shadow Balls all day long. Okay, now... I want to go with the safe protect, or do I want a toxic, because I really think something else is going to come in. No, you don't want a toxic, because you're bringing Keldeo, and Keldeo is going to poop on your parade if you do that. Vested, by the way, okay. Kind of figured that after it took a Specs Gengar Shadow Ball so well. Oh, don't tell me what you're going to do. So, it's going to HP, I, wow, I was expecting to live that. Well, well. So, at this range, Bandit Bullet Punch will be enough to take out, woof. Wow, wow, wow. And Keldeo's gonna come back out and kill something on my switch. Or Heatran's gonna come back out. I can live with that. Okay. Joe. Thank you for coming out. And um, have a safe flight. And let us know that you get back safely. Because it would be very unfortunate if something happened to one of the biggest GBA fans. I would cry. So this guy has lost no mons yet, and we've lost two. Because he's making the appropriate switches and plays, and we're not. Because booty. Do we have rocks up on his side of the field? We did. We set up rocks the first time. So we're just going to go with Scald. Shrek's going to come back out here. No burn luck this time. What's he going to do? I would have to guess. He could have Earth Power. Does he get any fighting moves? I'm trying to remember what we saw last time. Do we, I don't think we saw Leech Seed last time. Let's try the Ice Beam. T-Wave, not even worried about that. We're slower than slow anyways. I did a decent chunk. But I really think he's going to recover here. So we're just going to roar. Yep. And provided we're not dead, we're going to get a free shuffle of his team. He's going to drop Draco Meteor. We can take... That was a crit. That was a crit from a life orb. Okay. <laughs> crit from life orb thing. Yeah. Okay. So we need to survive one attack. And it would only make sense for him to go for the Sacred Sword here. I've got to go beyond an hour if you're still streaming. Okay, thank you for stopping by, Ivan. Go for Sacred Sword. Thank you! Thank you, we finally predicted something right! Goodness gracious. Okay, now he is for sure. I'm gonna protect here. I mean, he has to, right? No, he's gonna switch out. He. Oh, baiting the focus blast and got it. Didn't take it terribly well. Can we hit two in a row? Don't be dumb. Go into Empoleon. Don't tempt the fates for a miss. Just go into Empoleon. It'll take a Draco Meteor, and it'll take anything he has left. Go into Empoleon. That's what you want to do. Because that's the good, smart, safe play. 
League of Hidden Power... Dark, maybe? Oh, probably Hidden Power Fire, expecting Scizor to come out. I'm gonna guess that was an HP Fire. Just because that's my guess. So... It's gonna go for the Psy Shock, that does a decent chunk. Um, we're just gonna roar out because we're racking up Stealth Rock damage. And that is bueno. <sighs> now here we have to make a decision. What's he have left on this team? <sighs> Do we have the cojones? Is a question we need to ask ourselves. Go for the Scald. We can't risk anything coming in on a Lava Plume Burn. We might actually take an Earth Power. I don't remember how much it did. Okay, we're not going to take an Earth Power. That's fine. That's fine. We're going to go into Tracheon. And that's what we want. Come on, baby, switch. One time. Yes! Get the rock polish up. And we may sweep. Oh! Diggity dank! We may sweep with the X Scissor. Now, is he going to protect here? Is he going to protect? I can't risk it. Oh, I should have set up another... I, I should still outspeed. Now, we're going to go for the safe close combat because we don't want to miss a KO with a non-stab super effective move, even though this thing's a glass cannon. If he were... I would say double protect or aqua jet here, if he has it. I don't think we saw aqua jet last time we played. I think he had the waterfall. It would be a smart time to aqua jet if he had it just to get residual damage. Doesn't have it, and we're going to take it down. And that is going to be GG, because, well, I hope it's GG. Close combat should finish this thing off. Life Orb, don't think the crit mattered. Well, GG, Ray. Another fantastic match. Wow. Wow. That was crazy. Okay, so it's 5 o'clock. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's give a quick check. See what's going on in here. <laughs> okay. Got that, got that. A boom. Let's do a quick check through our tweets and things. I don't know what that is. Let's see what everybody's talking about. Everybody thinks it's hysterical that Steve's a turd. <sighs> oh, how many times has Tup pulled to Steve? 17 times. That is pretty funny, actually. Okay, we have... Wow, we got a bunch of new people that followed. The Demonic... Uh, the Gaming Electivire, Mega Man, Ivan, mm -hmm. Jess, Hept, Kanker, uh, Reina Cuddles, and... FSU Fan. FSU Fan! Ah! 
Ha! Huh. Thank you all, if you're still in the chat. So let's... I think we're going to do one more random-ish Whoa, what just happened? Okay, there we go. I think that's going to be our last viewer battle, and I think maybe get one or two more battles with this. Ooh. The ugliness of this team is incredulous. Okay, so what do we want to do? Rotom Wash doesn't do much against this team. Gliscor does a decent amount. Too bad we don't have Protect. I really just want to re lead off with Razzy. If I do, they're probably going to immediately switch out. Well, let's just start off with the Pokemon. Good luck. Have fun. Now, this is going to be his Mega. So, we don't want to... do anything crazy. Like, attempt to set up hazards yet. Because that would not be great. This guy's team conveniently dances around most of my threats. Which is very bad. Now, is he going to go for another Will-O-Wisp here? Is he going to switch out? I'm going to say he's going to go for another Will-O-Wisp or Recover. He's going to Recover. Okay. Not a problem. I want to say he's going to go into Heatran here. He could also go into Dragonite. Wow. Stayed in. And got burnt. That stinks. So we are going to be able to take him out with another Sacred Fire. So I really think he's going to switch. But I don't know what into. It's going to go into the Heatran. A Bulldoze would have just been masterful there. Let's do it now. Okay. Not even bad. Baiting? I don't know what he was baiting there. Um, half expecting a knockoff right here. So let's go into Klefki. Drain Punch. Wow, that did damage. Okay, well, let's... At least get the T-Wave off. Not that this thing's terribly fast to begin with, but even if we paralyze ourselves, if he brings in this, I'm not worried about it. Hot Rod, Hot Rod Bunny. Playing Super Serial here. And he stays in. And that's no bueno for us. So let's... What do we want to do here? This is our chance to bring in Razzy for free. Get our Mega off. Now if I had to guess... They're going to switch out and go into Ferrothorn to get the Iron Barb damage on me. That would make the most sense. So, doesn't switch out. Oh, that's so bad. <sighs> Conkholder has Life Orb. Okay. Okay. So we're just going to go for the Psyshock here, because 
Kind of have to. Gonna bring out Sylveon. And that was a crit. That was a really important crit. Um, another one probably isn't gonna be enough to take it out, which is really bad. I mean, if I get Entei in... Entei could probably just wallop through a lot of the rest of his team. Let's go for another Psy Shock. I'm gonna protect to get the health back. A smart play. And we don't have any... Th well, I mean, we could go into Kayente. Oh, man. Let's just go for the Psy Shock. Play it safe. Almost take this out. Probably gonna Wish Protect. No, Heal Bell. Okay. Okay. I can live with that. I'm gonna bring in Sableye. Should have switched up my moves there. But I didn't. Because Dingus Meningus. Gonna drop the Draco here to take out Sableye because that is going to uh, remove us from having to worry about um, Psy Shocking. I mean, granted, he can bring in Fire Thorn now. We do have HP Fire. But that's not going to do anything at minus two, especially if it's spe spe especially defensive variant. Okay, Dragonite's going to come out. Not what I wanted to see, but not really worried. Uh, we're going to go to Water Boy. Hopefully he DDs up here. Nope, Extreme Speed. Okay. That did a lot. So he must be banded. So we're going to switch out into Gliscor here. Banded Extreme Speed isn't going to do nearly enough. What do we want to do here? What do we want to do? <laughs> hmm. Set up the rocks here, get rid of his free switches. And this is the point where he's going to come in and set up the Leech Seed, which is no bueno. So we're going to go to Water Boy. I'm going to set up Spikes. Wow. And we're going to trick him here. Because I don't want him getting free recovery. So yeah. Woohoo. So he is locked into Leech Seed now. So, um, best thing I can do here is Volt Switch. Sylveon's gonna come out. We aren't gonna get the Volt Switch off, but he's also not gonna get any recovery, and I will. So that's good. Um, the best play... He's gonna go into Conkledur. Probably not his best play. But at the same time... I think we're just going to go for the Hydro Pump here. Wow. Crit kill. Do you plan on streaming on a regular basis? Um, as regular as I can. Um, Wednesdays are probably going to be the sweet spot days because they're the days that I guaranteed I'm going to be home alone. And no one running around. So that's... That's good on that end. So, but other than that, I don't know for sure how regular of a basis I will be, but as today, I will do my best to get up at least a short, hey, I'm streaming video on YouTube to let people know that I am streaming. We outsped, so he didn't go for extreme speed, which worries me a little bit. We're going to go into Sandy Claws. He's going to outrage, and that's fine. Um... How much damage did that do? 63%. Let's go for the knockoff. He's out. He's faster than us. How is it that Water Boy. What's Water Boy's speed? I didn't realize. Wow. Okay. <laughs> I'm dumb. But, anyways. Okay, he still has Heatran, which upsets me. But we are just going to go. Extreme speed here. Um, get damage. 
He was gonna switch out into Ferrothorn. Oh, extreme speed does give Iron Barbs recoil. That's unfortunate. We're just gonna go for the Sacred Fire here. He might have believed. I don't remember if we went for Bulldoze the last time. Might have believed we were. No, he wouldn't have believed we were Choice Locked. He wouldn't have. Okay. So what's this guy going to do? This is the closest, best battle we've had so far. We don't have... I have to keep an answer to Heatran around. I have to. Okay, at this point in extreme speed, should kill. And we should mop up with Bulldoze on Entei. If it doesn't, a Hydro Pump should finish it off. Oh, he just forfeits. Okay, well, we're only a few minutes out from when I said I would probably be finishing up the stream, so I think I'm going to finish the stream right there. Um, that'll be a nice two-hour upload to YouTubes. So if you would like to watch any part of the stream again, you can always do so on my Twitch, but also on my YouTube, because I try to upload my streams. So all right, guys, the stream will be uploaded tomorrow. So if you would like to relive the glory of it, teehee, you're more than welcome to do that. But all right, guys, this has been Old Man Top, and this has been a showdown stream. Thank you for coming out. Um, I encourage you to go, and we're going to do the raid thing. We're going to do the raid thing, and even if it's five people, let me get to... See who's still streaming. Okay, let's go find out who's still streaming. And I don't care if you stay in these channels. I won't lie, usually what I do, I run to the other channel and say, Yay, raid, and leave. So let's see who, who we watch. Why does that always happen? I go to the wrong stinking thing. <sighs> following button. How did I miss that the first time? And let's see who we're following. Okay, A Drive, Mogwai, and the Amazing Chi. Let's go. Excuse me. Let's go raid the Amazing Chi, because he is an awesome fellow and he deserves to be raided. So we're going to... Let's see if this works right. Host the Amazing Chi. Everybody go there. And I'll catch you on the flip side. Peace out, guys.